welcome to the Kadasan Canada guys Merry Christmas ho 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 and a happy new year if you will just see what's inside my car you'll see a bunch of Christmas presents and now I will be the Lady Santa or Mrs. Claus tonight we need to go and deliver the gifts so what would I do is I will just call them and then I'll make sure they're home anyhow I already called them and then I make sure I'm just fixing the camera sorry I make sure that they're home and then when they're home I will leave it at the front of their door and then press the bell and then they will just go and say when they got it they will just confirm it but we will not leave the gift unless we saw for, uh, from far that they already got it during this Christmas we don't know who are looking for each and everyone's Christmas presents right um, that's why be careful guys when you deliver Christmas gifts I know we want to do precautions like this um, safety precautions we will just give them a call and then letting them know we left the gifts at the front door or even their patio or at the lobby so we make sure that we are still staying there unless they confirm they got it even when they call when they call that uh, they said they confirm their home right just to make sure that no one will gonna steal our simple Christmas presents to our loved ones who deserve to be well appreciated not only here in Canada guys that we're doing Christmas gift exchange or exchanging of Christmas gift whatever we call it like secret Santa exchange gift we, are, we, we, we have something like Monito Monita. Is that Monito Monita is applicable here in Canada? I don't think so. But back home, we use it Monita Monita, right? We start, we're starting it like December. We have the secret giver of a simple items that every month we're, we have the specific gift that we will make sure we will buy the same thing. And then we will just give it secretly to our recipient as well to us our sender will just give it secret to us anyhow I just want to uh, more I just want to be more detailed and focused in regards to giving you a practical tip guys especially now Christmas we do online shopping and that's good we don't uh, recommend to go offline shopping especially boxing day i know uh, most of, of us we love the boxing day we, we will save a lot of money a lot of uh, dollars but we should save first our health so be safe we can do off uh, offline shopping with social distancing and we make sure that we tried first the online shopping okay back to the online shopping here's what the Amazon we we are advertising Amazon now is because one of our adver advertisement is Amazon and speaking of advertisement guys once you watch our videos please don't skip the ads please that's a big help for us to accumulate more of the revenues and of course YouTube as our partner will gonna be happy if we will watch the ads and we don't know those ads are very helpful to us and to our loved ones okay so when we do online shopping Amazon we can do check like with with them to track when is the delivery date right if we're not home so it will be a little slow before us is the truck I would like to do overtake but this one is just too 
two way like one of each lines I don't I don't want like be a bad example to you like a reckless driver so I prefer to wait anyhow there is wisdom in waiting okay we make sure that when we track our Amazon orders online for our loved ones or even to ourselves, someone will be home. Or we prefer that our buzzer activated at the lobby or the front door so that the delivery guy will just uh, call us, buzz us that our shopping, shopping is completed our gifts or anything else the stuff that we ordered is now available and one thing where we can also give our phone number so they can contact us once they arrive and we can tell them please um, give us one minute and then we will grab the products so in that way we are safe that no one can steal our that's we consider money it's because we use our money to purchase something from online right and of course we're not giving other people a chance to do bad things temptation once they are tempted they will be or out of curiosity they might steal it and keep it and own it but it's not good right so that is the practical tips that we can give to you as your loving Decadas in Canada and not just here in Canada not just here in Vancouver all over the world guys especially when there is special <laughs> occasions gift giving exchange giving online shopping deliveries and now it's Christmas so we we love to give pandemic will not stop our tradition or the bit of our heart to show how much we appreciate our families and loved ones so that's only one of the practical tips that we can share to you guys is please make sure that someone will receive the delivery since someone is home when the delivery arrive like us is from united states my brother he sent a package to denise here in vancouver so we as a special in uh, special instruction that once they arrive in our place is they're gonna give us a call so they gave us a call and that's the time we receive the special Christmas gift of Denise. Thank you so much again to my Kuya. Kuya is a big brother, my sibling. You're super generous. Since birth, you are very generous in your simple way. Even though we're not making much money before, we're just making enough and sometimes it's not even enough. You never fail to show how much you love us as your siblings and especially our parents you gave them everything that can make them happy and we are all proud of you that is the practical tip actually the word practical tip it came from my brother also who you do it saying much better to use practical tips rather than giving information in regards to Canada application for of course we're a disclaimer we're not the licensed immigration officer or even a consultant immigration right so anyhow back to our gift giving Christmas when we do exchange gift don't expect that the exact amount that you give is the exact amount that you will receive Remember, the greatest blessings, our greatest Christmas present comes to the smallest package, and that's Jesus Christ. He was born in a manger rather than in a castle. Okay, that's it guys. I hope you enjoy our simple 
but nice chat while driving here in Vancouver, Canada. You enjoy how it looks like and it's just 4.30 in the afternoon. Once again, please don't forget to leave a comment for our improvement and please, 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 please don't skip the ads because we know that's your full support to us. Like and always subscribe. First is our daughter's channel. Next, for monetize, Denise's secret channel. And second is Sir is online and our very own Dick Hara, Sir Canada. Bye, guys.